So, welcome to my stream. I'm um, driving on Maria's Pass, uh, gas on to Kalispell. It's a scenario done by Winston. So I'm checking these out. Got a nice little switcher. Long day working in the Columbia Falls area. One last one before you head home. Rate of drop date. Blah, blah, blah. Uh, so... I'm trying out these scenarios by Winston to see what they're like. I've done a bunch by RB Jets. Clear to reverse onto the siding, go to the end, um, stop short of the switch. Okay, that would be, first of all, let's take the brake off. And then let's put a bit of brake back on. Actually, local brake. Clear, I believe, to do this. Falls 3201 East. Speeding? Where the hell was I speeding? the throw the switch? What switch? Well, this one. Ah, I getcha. I'm here. And, okay, we've... Wait a minute. How the hell do I get get to Columbia 3201 East? Oh, I go up here. Oh. 
Okay. Oops. <clears throat> I'm possibly blocking the uh, crossing. I see what he does, so he doesn't give you that explicit directions. Yes, you figure it out. This string of cars to the back. Okay. It doesn't say go here and then hold for this switch and then hold for this switch and then. Break on and override it with power, maybe. Yes, we can. Okay. This is maybe. Oops, again. Move, move down. Down, down. Why is the mouse not? There we go. Oh, we can't see the local brake actually on the gauge, so. No throttle? Looking for a throttle gauge. Not sure what that thing there is. It's hard to see. It doesn't budge. Well, this is a kind of a lame engine. said, don't go past the dwarf signal. Now he'll flick that thing behind me. Okay. I'll take that off. I'll put that on. So, I think I've discovered that I don't really like this engine. The scenarios are good. Engine is done. save.
Jeez, it's really hard to back up with that much brake, isn't it? Christ. Exit the yard by 3201 West. Use caution when approaching the signal for crossovers. Okay, I can do that. Gotta check whether there's a trick here. Let's put a, a, a couple of, let's put a break on and see what happens. Actually, actually, okay, so that is off, not this one. Let's put just, um, let's try this with just a bit of break. Down to nothing. And then add that much, that much. Take that off. Let's see if we can back up with this load. Okay, it's doable. Let's see if we have any break at all here. Call the power. Yeah, we do, okay. So, three is pass. What hell of a train to push with this little guy, but I think that's the issue. sucks. I've, um, good. Uh, that sucks. I've never had a broken arm. Okay. 
knock on wood. Second time on the same arm. Well, that sucks. Oh, we suppose we could do the horn. Doesn't really help to do the horn, does it? Uh, main 2 West. I guess we're going to Main 2 West, are we? Main <coughs> 2 West, it looks like it. It's blue. The map does in blue things that it wants you to um, where the track is going. So uh, That's too bad. I mean, did you fall or how did you break your arm? Oh, I'm going to be going 70 here. Okay. <clears throat> I didn't realize this. Let's go. Oh, uh, that's too bad. <laughs> and I know, since you are uh, not from North America, Specifically, not for the United States when you say you're playing football. Um, you mean football, not football. Was this a, uh, was this just a friendly pickup game or are you in a league or are you professional or what, what the level of, um, Omar, Omar, hello Omar, how are you doing? Welcome to my stream. I am not a real train driver. Uh, would be fun to do that, but never have done that. So, this is saying, uh, red on the main line, green to switch. We're switching up here. Nope, have never been a real train driver or a real truck driver. However, I also sometimes play Call the Hunter Call of the Wild. I have been a real hunter. I played it after uh, I did. I played Call of the Wild yesterday after a couple of months off and forgotten how to work all the switches and buttons. I think I got an elk and a moose. Scared away a whole whack of elk, so. Um, I like the train drive because it is relaxing and mellow. Um, I go online. I'm uh, I'm not good at shoot 'em up games. I'm an old guy, eh? I don't have the reflexes. tracks here though. Funny we don't have a speed limitation. Worried they were going to let us do it. That's not realistic actually. To be doing 70 on that kind of change? No. Uh, I, I, I play ETS2 and I do simulators. ETS2, ATS, Call of the Wild, and this train simulator. That's I guess the four games I play. I did some Mud Runner slash Spin Tires a while ago, but I think in a while. But, um, well, I mean, uh, games where you've got to battle people in that, or where you have spells, I, I forget what spells I have and what key is which or whatever, and I don't have a lot of agility in my left hand anymore. 
I mean, it's okay, but but you know the the fingers slow down sometimes. So try to do quick things with the various keys. Here, yeah, need to enter the branch line to Callan's Bell. Oh, good. Trying to do that uh, just doesn't work for me. So my I can't play those kind of games. Where the hell am I going? I'm going here. And I'm supposed to be... I'm supposed to be going there. So how the hell did I get going down there? I think I was supposed to back up. I believe I was supposed to back up and go here. Or go forward. gone a little over. Uh, well, with a broken arm, it'd be hard to play things, yeah. happening here rather than getting wandering in the chat and uh, <clears throat> relaxing a little too much. Started just a sec. There we go. Ah, uh, still early morning flip. Oh well. I started playing uh, EDS two before ATS and played ETS two for several years. Even after ATS came out, I wasn't that impressed with the map, but I'm still not impressed with it. Uh, the nice thing about ATS is the add-ons. Coast to coast, uh, Midwest expansion, Sierra Nevada, all three of those really help the United States map. Uh, 
I don't know what helps. ETS 2 has always been, it started earlier, it's always been more detailed. It's uh, a lot more, places are a lot closer together in Europe than in, in the US, so they've been forced to have more detail. So I, I quite enjoy things like bags of dirt. I quite enjoy it. have a um, signal coming up. Okay. Let's uh, verify that we are in fact still going to the right place. I just added that. Sorry. Damn, I caps that. I know. I have a thing for if you do more than 10 emoticons, but I added the caps thing too. <laughs> the bot got you. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Uh, makes life a little more entertaining, right? <laughs> oh. Speaking of which, 787, I have sent a postcard a couple of days ago. Uh, I think it was one of a flower from the uh, bont botanical collection of the... Uh, I don't know. Something gallery. Something gallery in... Uh, <laughs> let's see what they are. New York Bot Botanical Gardens. Oh. <laughs> they got you again. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So you'll get your you'll get your postcard. Um, I guess I could take the caps off. I, I, well, I don't know. So uh, let me know when it gets there, because I mailed it uh, with days today. Tuesday. I think I mailed it Tuesday. So we'll see how long mail takes to get from here to Singapore. Uh, yes, what time is it there now? Eleven minutes past midnight. Oh, so you're twelve hours off. That's that's good to know. Okay. Well, I had intended to start earlier this morning, and um, I think I'm going to do that. I think I'm going to do some early morning ones. Get up, get my coffee, sit down, game for an hour. Right now it's tw it's eleven minutes, uh, twelve minutes after twelve. 
it's 12 minutes past noon in Canada. In the end, well, we've got five time zones. Five? Five and a half? Um, I'm Eastern. Daylight time. British Columbia is three hours past me. And um, east of me, there's um, one zone east of me, the Atlantic provinces, and then uh, Newfoundland is another half hour past that, so. But glad you caught it, and thank you for the host. And glad you popped in, and as I said, yeah, let me know when your card shows up. That'll be interesting. I sent one to my friend, uh, I think the same time, I sent one to my friend in Australia. Or maybe not, I'll have to check my schedule. And anybody else that wants a postcard, let me know. Ah, he got me a message on Instagram. Good. I hardly ever go to Instagram. I don't understand. I, I get confused. I'm not sure how to use Instagram. Maybe I should look at a video as to how the hell do you use Instagram. And I think it only works on... I don't think it works. I don't think there's a web version. I think Instagram is only on... Phones and tablets, right? Oh no no! I just I I I I'm not sure. I mean, people have stories on Instagram. A lot of people have stories, and I I read something in somebody's story, and I want to I want to comment on it, and then it scrolls on to the next thing, like the next little bit, and I can't go back and say, oh, I wanted to say that was good, bad, or indifferent. So. They'll have a whole bunch of little bars at the top of their screen, and it cycles through things, and I don't know. Yeah, it scrolls to the next story, sort of, I don't know, the story. The next thing, see, that's, see, I don't know. I don't know Instagram. Uh, oh, just hit left on the screen? Hit left, do you mean, or scroll left? I should try that then. See, that's what I mean. There could be basic things. Because uh, I try to put my photos up on Instagram, although if I put them on Instagram and Facebook, Instagram, um, the combo app I've got makes me profit for Instagram. Okay, so we are driving here uh, past lumber yards and such. Hopefully not. I think so going right through here. Well, that's interesting the way this shadow shouldn't go like that. Interesting uh, yard we're going through. Uh, part of where he has passed, the uh, non pass part of where he has passed, I guess. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Yes, that's 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 where they hide people. Yes. Yes, I know it's in the industrial park. I don't know. Well, in the back of the video, I could see just a slight picture of a tower. So, according to my calculation, that tower is that far from this building and this angle. So it has to be in here. All right.
though I've learned, I haven't, uh, I don't know if I've done any of Winston's uh, scenarios, this particular guy's scenarios. I don't know if I've done any of them before, but I've learned from this one that uh, RB Jets tends to, he says, put on a whistle, but nobody will hear it. can't do a short one, so it's hard to do two longs to shorten a long. Ah! <laughs> oh, thank you very much. I appreciate that. Uh, so we're dropping everybody on Columbia Falls High Line Siding, which is Yes, up here. Let's just look and see. No, we've got a uh, one, two, three switches to go through. We will be there in a bit, but not quite yet. So, I think I actually have to do something productive today to, like, maybe... Uh, maybe just tidy some stuff up. That'd be nice. Even though I'm from home and I was from home before, this thing sort of get a little casual. Fifteen? Where did this fifteen come from? interesting, but where the hell did this 15 come from? Had a bit more break, and then we stopped pretty quick. Okay, so dump everybody there. that was the command was drop off. Uh, we can look at it with this too. And we can see that the last one is 174 and the first one is 287. So we're dropping off everybody. Pick up diesel fuel from somewhere. fuel and there so that means that I have to go here and then back up and get diesel fuel okay I brought it back all my strong base on Monday and now I'm pretending it's not just brought back all your army stuff from base on Monday and now not just sitting in my living room. Uh, I did not know that you are in, so you're in the armed forces. Is your day job that you're in the armed forces and you're sent, that you've been sent home because you broke your arm, or? may have told me about that and I may have just forgotten. 
Oh, uh, every Singaporean guy serves two years. Oh, okay. Interesting. Uh, yeah, Israel does the same thing, don't they? I believe. Ah, you finish on Monday. That'll be good. Now tell this guy. Okay, I'm going to go that. We're going to go like that. Or we're going to go like that. a decent salary do you, you um, do you learn a trade while you're doing that or do you also get you know can you will they pay for the university so many questions so many questions oh I can see I'm almost out of gas as I wandered around. And what is the army and what is the army used for in Singapore? Is it used uh, for uh, in case there's a disaster? Okay. I just wondered what the army does. I know Costa Rica, uh, I'm pretty sure Costa Rica, when we were down there, I don't know, a decade ago, my sister and I, we were told that in Costa Rica they do not have an army, and they use the ar money that they would spend on an army instead on a uh, school program, education program. So the money they would spend on an army all goes into, and then I'm not sure then who protects Costa Rica against their neighbors. Um, don't know. thought it was an interesting strategy. Because actually you'd think that if you spent your money on education instead of army and you then raise the standard of living and the level of education for your country, your country would be lot better and suddenly would be a, a better target for somebody else to invade. It's like, well, shit. Oh, that's true. Probably true also, yeah. Uh, well, that's interesting. We've got to go in there to get fuel. Okay, somehow. switch here. I'm going to put a bit of brake on. Enough to stop us. Stop 
let's do a save here. This looks like this could be tricky. Uh, there seems to be a guy manning every junction where there's, um, in this particular implementation of the game. Our gas is going up. Um, well, I need to apply some brakes because I don't want to ram into... I need to stop eventually, right? Uh, and I would rather... What I often do is I put on enough brakes so that if I have no power, I'll slow down. But I can put on power to go more than the brakes. Like, like driving with your foot on the brake pedal a little bit. Probably a bad idea, but... Because uh, I'd rather not have to put the brakes on, turn the brakes off, put the brakes on, turn the brakes on, but I guess I have to, so, in this case. So let's go back and see where we're going. Uh, so, we are here. And our next task is to go up and get... Oh, go and get everybody. So, I just had to get fuel. You know, this is weird. No, I guess not. I could have stopped on the main line, gone in, got fuel, gone back out, and gone ahead, but that would have blocked the line, so... Once I've got a bunch of cars behind uh, a train, what I do often is I just put, set the brake on, on a couple of cars. set the brake in a couple of cars so there's a bit of a drag. Oh, oh this brake is still on. Okay, take it off. I get past this guy and he will throw the switch for me. Well, he won't throw the switch for me. I'll throw the switch for myself, but...
sky. Funny little, uh, yeah, funny little warehouse. So, um, how how much how much more do we have to do with this trip? Let's just see where the hell we are. We gotta pick up those guys, go up to here, drop everybody off, then go up to here, and then stop. Unemployed, but a civilian. Now, how was it being? Um, uh, how? I just I don't know. What are the restrictions like in Singapore in terms of COVID? I assume they locked, they were able to lock the whole country down. And, uh, but now you have to find a job. Same here, a lot of this has been locked down here. Um, and I'm not sure really how that, you know, you lock it down and uh, nobody gets it now, but they're gonna get it eventually, so. Oh, buy food in the stalls but not dine in? Yeah, pretty well what we got here. Uh, the city park, you could walk through the city park. You could not stop and sit on a bench. You could not play in a play structure. Could not, um, couldn't stop. You had to keep on moving. You walk through the park. They've changed it now. Now you can um, stop in a park. If your family's with you. You can play catch. Uh, you can sit on the grass and have a picnic. Yeah. Uh, we can sit. I mean, you can walk on the sidewalk and there's benches. You can sit. In a Sure, you can sit on the benches along the sidewalk. The problem here with nobody sitting on benches was they can't clean the benches in the park. sanitize the benches between uses, but they don't really worry about sanitizing the uh, grass. So now you can stop, have a picnic, sit on the grass, and you can bring your own lawn chair too. Bring your own lawn chair, sit beside them. A different sort of life for people. I'm surprised I haven't had more people uh, picking up my offer for a free postcard. Uh, maybe some people are reluctant to give out their real name and address. Uh, maybe some people are afraid they'll catch something from a postcard, but I don't know.
there. Now I can take that brake off. I can go here and I can put a little bit of brake on. And we can still go. It's just a little, uh, you know, a little switcher engine. Uh, I'm not even sure what the horsepower is, if the horsepower is rated. Engine, brake pipe, blah, 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 and meter. 1,500 amps. I don't know. trains are cool and actually there is a DLC for this game you can you can drive the Japanese bullet train um, I'm not big on passenger runs I'm just not keen on the stress of uh, having to make it on time from station to station and slow properly and speed up properly but uh, it might be interesting have the bullet train even just just for the sake of seeing what it looks like to drive through Japan. Do you have a bell? We do have a bell. FW learned uh, someone online would be from your area. Um, I don't know what TFW is. The funny word, the funny word, the, f the fuzzy willy That Philly one you learned someone online might be from your area. Uh, Ah! <laughs> gotcha! <laughs> what did you get, uh, what was that for? I didn't see. I'll have to look and see what was, um... The emote is three caps? Oh, well, that's annoying. Uh, it's just a sec, because I'll, I'll go in and I'm going to go in and turn that off then, because that's annoying. I don't really, I don't really mind it that much if somebody uses caps. Uh, there we go. Turned it off. Okay, back in the saddle again here. Probably need a light on in the front. There we go. 
<laughs> Thank you for the testing. <laughs> really? Uh, that's annoying. Oops. Uh, we possibly are going too fast now. Uh, we're possibly still going too fast. Oh, I see what we can do. There we go. break here. Not much. It's pretty hard to control the brakes on this little uh, switcher, this little 1500 switcher. Okay, we'll see you again when I'll uh, I'll try to be earlier or later. <laughs> Either uh, you can catch me tonight too, you know, after supper. Seven o'clock for me, eight o'clock for me at night, eight o'clock for you in the morning. But uh, thank you very much for your. Um, and please, no, sir. Just because I'm old and gray. <laughs> but thank you for the sir. But uh, have a good stream tomorrow. Enjoy your. Um, Enjoy your day. Ta ta. <laughs> so, I'm discovering uh, this Winston uh, scenario that he um, his scenarios are not that explicit, which is good. He just says, well, do this. You know. Look these guys to the back of your engine on uh, this bit of your siding, and it's up to you to figure out, oh, okay, so that means I have to go around. Get there. The brakes are either too much. The brakes are on pretty hard, and that is that much brake. So not much at all. I've got no, um, yeah, I've got no engine brake. The only smaller uh, setting is Can add that much. See, even that much is too much. We get nothing set on any cars. That little bit is too much. Which I can't do. I, the most I can do is running. Although it's a small. Yes, the Mies Brass one, yeah. It's a small, um, it's a small switcher, but still. And I had the problem with the other ones that I was doing, whatever that was, the, was it an SD40 or whatever, and the other RB Jets ones. I had that problem um, where if you're over 10 pounds, 10, 12 pounds on brake, um, you get no power run the throttle up and you look at the power meter, it's sitting at zero. Oh, I don't know why that's happening. Oh, I've got my... Uh, 
light coming in through the blinds. I probably should have cleaned my glasses. Oh, here's the um, here's the mask my daughter made for me. Side. When I come back in, I'm going to have to, I suppose I have to wash it. Because it will have been. Um, Contaminated, likely, from being out and about, touching my, my mask, touching things with my hands and touching my mask. So. And she shared the pattern online, too. I had a couple of friends on the Facebook saying, Oh, that's cool. Where'd you get that? A friend of mine's got two little kids. He wants to get the kids to it wearing a mask and uh, if they had really cool ones then they would want to do it. Go via um, Kalispell, Maine 861617. and oil. Yeah, they are slightly different cars. I'll be taking much longer than it should because I've been rarely doing, oh yeah, sorry, rarely doing the speed limit. There are some night runs in this game, not a lot of them, and I don't really like night runs because what can you see in a night run? It's bad enough here, although if you hang out the window, like that. sit on the bumper. That's interesting. Oh, well, we can do that too. other uh, scenarios that I've got from Windsor uh, is on the Fort Kent subdivision. Uh, day in the North Northwoods. And that one has, it's in snow and it has a lot of com commands to marshal. Marshal here, marshal there, stuff like this. So. Ah, 
Grab Winston's Isle of Wight and Great Western Mainline Options. Plus, as Miami wins the series at Donner. Oh yeah, they're interesting. They are, like I said, they're less detailed than um, RB Jets. RB Jets would say, go to here, hold here, then clear the switch, back up here, pick up these things. Whereas uh, Winston seems just to, uh, yeah, pick up those things. See, those, see that stuff over there? Yeah, hook it up to the back. This is Maria's pass, but um, not a lot of pass involved in this part. Look here. Up there. There's wobbly stuff. That would be the Maria stuff pass where it's wobbly because there's curves to go up and down the mountains. Too. Now I'm surprised they don't have more than these on this on this Fort Kent. Um, I don't seem to have any scenarios. I'll uh, I'll look after I finish this run. And um, speaking of finishing this run, I got another 20 minutes real time to go. Uh, I don't even have any, uh, I looked in the career, there's nothing, there's nothing, it's not there. Oh, but is it a DLC? I'm trying to think now. Is this Fort Kent a DLC or was it somebody's route for the workshop? Should be stuff there for it. I'll look again after, but um, um, what do you mean there are eleven entries for it? You say you've never seen it, the eleven entries for it. Eleven? So there's eleven. Oh, oh, your your point is eleven is very low for a DLC. I suppose so. My job to. One of my jobs can be to um, utilize that. Find those entries and play them. Now 39 and 